a baby's t-shirt requires 4 fifths yards of fabric, or 4 fifths of a yard of fabric, how many t-shirts can be made from 48 yards? So what we want to do is we essentially want to say, how many groups of 4 fifths of a yard can we make with 48 yards? So you literally view this as we want to take 48 yards. So we want to take 48 yards and divide it into groups of 4 fifths of a yard and say, how many groups are there? Because each of those groups can make one baby's t-shirt. If you give me 4 fifths of a yard, one baby's t-shirt. So the number of groups of 4 fifths is the number of baby's t-shirts. Now, when we divide by a fraction, we just have to remember that that is the same thing. That is completely equivalent to multiplying to multiplying times the reciprocal of the fraction. So if we have 4 fifths here, that'll be 5 over 4, the reciprocal. Now, this still might say, hey, I have a whole number here and a fraction. And you just have to remember, any whole number can be written as a fraction. This is the same thing as 48 over 1 times 5 over 4. Now, we could just multiply it out at this point, figure out what 48 times 5 is, and that'll be over 4. But that'll get big numbers, and it'll be hard to kind of divide and all that. But we could divide at this stage right here. We could divide the numerator and the denominator by 4. Or we could say, look, this is going to be equal to 48 times 5, whatever that is, over 4. Now, let's divide the numerator by 4. Well, we could divide 48 by 4. And we will get 12. And we can, whatever we did to the numerator, we have to do the denominator. So if we divide 4 by 4, we get 1. So then we're left with 12 times 5, which is equal to 60. 12 times 5, which is equal to 60 over 1, which is the exact same thing as 60. So you can actually make 60 children's or babies' t-shirts from 48 yards if each of them use 4 fifths of a yard.